Well, there's probably three main areas of mitigation that um, are worthy of exploration. Uh, the most obvious and simplest is to support young people to stay in education rather than having them tr transition out into a very difficult situation, support them with funding or whatever to enhance their qualifications or skills uh, or devise new types of skills training uh, to help them enhance their um, uh, their own capacity uh, so that they can ride out the storm and by the time this economy starts to pick up again they're in a better position to get out and look for jobs so that's one option keep keep them in education for a while uh, another is to um where there are opportunities that currently exist even where they've reduced then uh, preferentially target those on young people who are coming out of education so for example in um uh, apprenticeships. We know the number of apprenticeships have gone down, but perhaps they should be targeted on young people who are leaving education right now so that they're able to deal with that sort of that first rung, as it were. Um, the third possibility is to is for a, a version of the, the, what the government has been doing around uh, support for employment, and that is to provide uh, sort of full time paid internships or something equivalent for young people for a year again as a way of trying to deal with this transition period and giving them some work experience uh, helping employers at the same time uh, and helping to promote economic activity so th those are three different ways of trying to, to potentially address some of these immediate short-term problems mm -hmm.